Good morning, Mentham family, and welcome to another video here, you guys. I'm still here at my grandma's here, but today, here later on, later this afternoon, I do have to go back home, you guys, because I got to go back to work on Tuesday. Um, we had a really great 4th of July weekend here. It was an absolute banger for sure, so I'm a little bit tired right now. I just woke up maybe not too long ago. I'm still in my pajamas here, as you guys can see, but I'll... I had a really good night of sleep here, so um, we are still having a couple of my relatives coming in here in a little bit here. Um, we actually have a couple of them coming in from North Carolina as well, so they're going to be here in a couple hours here. So um, not sure if I'm going to be able to vlog it with them, you guys, because obviously you know, they know I'm a YouTuber, but I don't know how exactly they would feel being on camera to a social media platform i don't know but regardless so i hope you guys are having a great start to your day if you're new to my channel here people smash the subscribe button for me and turn on that notification bell so you guys can be notified for our new video every wednesday and saturday at 9 a.m eastern time you guys so let's just go ahead and jump in to see how what today has in store for us because obviously it sounds like we're getting some rain here later on this afternoon so probably not going to be able to do any reptile adventures here at here on the island so a little bummed out about it but regardless though let's just see what the today is going to show us so you guys it's already about three o'clock in the afternoon we're cooking this turkey here for dinner but unfortunately i'm not gonna be able to attend it here because obviously i gotta catch the boat here probably in another couple more hours so it's kind of unfortunate i have to miss this turkey dinner but i'm kind of be kind of glad though because i've got a feeling next weekend i'm gonna be coming back here if i have a chance you guys so regardless uh bigger i just wanted to share a little bit of a little fyi with you sorry a little bit of a moment there sorry <laughs> But uh, regardless, it's just absolutely, uh, been, I've had a blast here on the island, you know, for the 4th of July. So, um, like I said, hopefully I got a chance next weekend to come back. So, and fingers crossed we can, because, I mean, obviously my relatives are going to be still here this coming weekend. So, uh, we got to go ahead and catch the boat here in a little bit, get all my stuff together, and uh, get in the car here. So, kind of sad, but at the same time, though, this is only part one of two, actually, the adventures with my relatives. So, hopefully we can get that part two to come, right? I just missed the boat, you guys. Just missed it just by only a few seconds. Oh. But don't worry, you guys. Since they're going to be running both boats here, I'm, I'm in no hurry. I'm kind of surprised, though. My grandma told me she thinks there was going to be a long line while I'm sitting here, but apparently not. That's kind of surprising, you guys. It's about 4.30, so I'm not sure why it's not a busy line, so... Maybe it's just because maybe some people are still sticking around in the island, maybe just for a couple days. So, but um, I guess they do have a reason why they have to leave kind of soon because there is an ambulance on that boat now. So, um, so they're gonna pe put the throttle at full power on this ferry, you guys, as you can see right there. They're going full power already. So, but regardless, though, the other ferry should be crossing here any minute. So, I'm in no hurry here, you guys. So, uh, but regardless, uh, oh, someone's already coming in. So, anyway. They're gonna have to wait here for probably a good maybe 20 30. Never mind, folks. Boat number two is arriving, so only about a 10 minute wait there. So, well, I think once they get these cars off, we're gonna be loading on. So, I'm gonna be kind of glad to go back home for the next few days. Uh, not exactly this looking forward to going to work, but but hey, if I want to actually get a place of my own and start my dream, you know, I gotta start make, working real things in real life. So, welcome to the adult world, guys. That's just how it's gonna be. So, here in a couple minutes, they should be letting us on board, and uh, we'll be on our way home, people. So, can't wait to see my animals and my family. All right, we just got on board the boat. Next stop, the mainland of the UP. And I'm back here at the house, everybody. So, let's go ahead and take a look and see what's going on with my animals here. Starting with Lucy here. She's obviously wondering what's going on already here, because I just got home, you silly monkey. And it looks like she's done pretty good so far. Cage looks really good. It looks like there's just going to be a little bit of spot cleaning to do here, obviously, for sure, for most of their cages. Uh, let's see here. We got... Let's see, where is she? Where is Elliot? She's somewhere in here. She's probably in her little cave, I would imagine, so... So yeah, that's one, two girls down, and let's go ahead and check on Ariel here, and it looks like she also had a little bit of fun too in here. So obviously, yep, definitely some spot cleaning for you, for sure, because you obviously like to make a mess. And uh, as for Tyson, not too much. He did shed too, you guys, when I got back home, so that's obviously pretty cool, you guys, that he's still growing on me. No pun intended, by the way. <laughs> 
And then finally, Van Halen, he looks really good too. I'm gonna go ahead and actually give him some a, a little pinky mouse here in a little bit, you guys, because he hasn't eaten in a week, so I obviously gotta give him some food, because if I want this little guy to actually grow pretty soon, obviously I gotta give him some food pretty quick here, so probably after dinner, I'll give him his dinner also, so. But regardless, all my animals look really good here, you guys. It's only been only a few days, but I really did miss them very much. But I tell you what, though, I think there's going to be some stuff coming up here pretty soon that I'm going to share with you guys. And uh, don't, I'm not going to spoil it just yet. So regardless, though, I'm just glad to be back home with my animals and just glad to spend a little time with my family as well. My boy Van Halen has been waiting all day now to get his dinner. So let's go ahead and give it to him because he's just sitting here in his little tree looking at me thinking, you got me any food? Just a cute little guy. All right, bud. Whenever you're ready to take it, come on down. Come on down, bud. Come on, come on and take it. Come on, bud. It's all right. It's exactly what you love. It's exactly what you needed. Come on. Don't be a shy bud. Come on. Oh, yeah. You definitely smell it now. Come on up. Come on. Come on down. Come take it. I know you want it. Come on. Don't be a picky eater. Don't be picky. Don't be picky. Let's go. Come on. Come and get it. Come and get it. Come and get it. This is a Can you please take it because I'm losing my grip here a little bit on these tones. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, there you go. That a boy. Way to go. He didn't seem too sure if he was interested in it for a moment, but I saw that tongue flicking rapidly going. He, he had some more interest, so I wasn't sure at first if he was going to take it, but there he goes. He's just a little chomper, I can tell you that for sure. Absolutely just a cute little monkey, though. Just thinking about two more years, he's probably going to be twice the size than he is right now. So hopefully maybe in a few years we can breed him to my girl Lucy. And uh, we can have some more cute little baby Lucys and Van Halens here in the future. So just an absolutely cute little fella he is. So what you guys just saw there was the moment of truth. And um, this is something I've been really wanting to get for the last couple years. And um, apparently, it's been a really tough decision to do. And um, apparently, the moment has finally come true. We're about to open this package up here because I'm super duper excited to share this moment with you guys. So, I'm not gonna tell you quite what it is yet, but I am super excited to show you. So, we'll go ahead and just jump right into it. So, let's just go ahead and see what's in this package here, people. I'm just so excited. Alright guys, this is it. Moment of truth. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Holy Toledo. Holy Toledo. This is amazing. OMG you guys, look how little she is. Look at that. Look at how little she is, you guys. Holy macro. Look at that, you guys. That's right. It's a baby albino garter snake here, you guys. It's absolutely adorable. Oh, wow. Hi, honey. Oh, my goodness. You are super tiny. Holy moly, you guys. I can't believe I'm looking at this, you guys. This thing is so little. This thing's even smaller than my guy Tyson when we first got him, you guys. That is just amazing. Oh, wow. You are so adorable. Holy mackerel. Whew. Okay, you guys. I just got to set her down real quick. She's not squiggly right now, which is good. But at the meantime, though, holy mackerel. Uh, my heart's racing right now. Holy mackerel. This is amazing. Absolutely adorable. This is just amazing. I'm not going to want to handle her yet, you guys, because she just arrived today. So I'm not going to try and cause any stress on her whatsoever. So. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and set her up in her little bin here for a little bit and uh, we'll go ahead and let her just get some relaxation and uh, she'll be good to go from there but absolutely amazing you guys absolutely just wanted to share that moment with that with you I mean take a look at her I mean isn't that adorable I mean come on that, is, that can't be the cutest thing in the world now can it but regardless though 
absolutely beautiful, you guys. 100%. Absolutely gorgeous looking little girl. Holy moly moly. Wow. Reminds me of when Van Halen was that little too. But holy cow, this is going to be absolutely incredible, you guys. Think about it. In a few years from now, we might be able to pair them up, Tyson and this cute little girl here soon. But uh, not going to try and jinx it out yet, you guys. This, this is, is just absolutely amazing. But for now, like I said, let's go ahead and just set up her in our quarantine bin. And we'll go ahead and just see what we can do from there from uh, here. All right, Lucy. Time for you to eat. Come on, girl. Let's go. Come on. You see the tones? That's it. Come on. Yeah, now she knows what time it is. <laughs> Every time I click those tongues, you guys, she knows what time it is. Look at her. Look at her. She's already knowing what it time it is. I just love it when she does this. So it is feeding time for her. So we got to give her her dinner before I actually turn out her light. But look at her. Isn't it crazy, you guys? Literally, ever since the day she was born, now how much she's grown. I mean, literally, it could be another year, year and a half until she's big enough to breed, you guys. So um, not going to be in a rush for that quite yet, you guys, because I got to save a little money, actually, and probably get ready for a baby rack system in the near future. So but regardless, so, like I said, Lucy just looks absolutely gorgeous. So let's go ahead and give her her dinner because she's not going to be wanting to wait patiently very long. So we'll go ahead and jump right into it. Ooh, whoa, what are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, girl, come on. Come on, big girl. It's over here. It's over here. Yeah, there you go. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's over here. It's, it's over there. <laughs> there she goes. Like I said, no matter what, you guys, every time I click those tons in front of her, she instantly gets turned on for food. That means she knows it's feeding time. So, again, though, some people think snakes are stupid, but this proves me. This proves that Ron right here, she's super duper smart when it comes to feeding. So, just gonna go ahead and actually just let her enjoy her dinner before I call it a night. So, absolutely a cute little girl, but I still love her to death. And last but not least, to feed here for the night, people, is my girl Ariel, the big girl of all of these ladies here. So, all right, sweetheart, it's all yours. Come and get it. Come and get it. Come and get it. Yep. There you go. <laughs> That is a good coil, girl. Perfect one, too, boys and girls. Holy Toledo. This never gets old. I just like loving this, you guys. I just remember seeing this in pictures and videos and stuff, but never in person did I think it could be possible. But it's so awesome to witness this in my own room. So absolutely a phenomenal sight to see here for sure. So I'm going to go ahead and just, like I said, that's like I always do with my animals. Just let them, you know, get a little time for themselves. Because obviously you don't want to cause too much stress to them while they're eating while they're eating for sure so regardless absolutely a cute girl and um even though she may be big and might try to act a little tough but i know deep inside of her she has a really good soul in her boys and girls that's gonna go ahead and wrap this vlog up here for the night you guys so it's absolutely awesome to finally get tyson a future girlfriend here even though like i said she's only a baby you guys only about a month old but hopefully maybe in a few years from now we'll be able to actually to pair them up one day and we can actually have some more baby baby garter snakes and hopefully we can find good homes for them too in the future so regardless i'm gonna go ahead and end it here for the day here if you guys enjoyed this video here's a playlist you guys of some of my other animals here like including lucy the garter snake you guys want to go ahead and check her out you guys and over here you guys Guys, go ahead and subscribe for me if you guys want to do that please it would really mean a lot to my channel you guys because i do work hard to make content on this channel very very hard you guys so regardless i'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here people i promise i'll see you guys on the next one